Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be creating a timer like this example here. It's going to count up every second and this can be added to any game 2D or 3D. So you're going to want to start by going to my games and creating a new game. I'm going to edit an already existing one but you can create a new project. You're going to want to open the editor and create a new empty object. The player won't see this on the screen, so make sure you drag it somewhere that they can't see. You're going to want to go to Behaviors, leave all the default settings blank, and create a Once trigger. Next, you're going to want to create a label from the GUI menu. You're not going to connect this to anything. This is going to say Timer. You can change the color and the size and the font of this. Timers like these are used in games like Mario. Next, you're going to want to create a timer trigger. And you're going to want to connect the output of the once trigger to the start timer. You're going to want to set this to repeat forever and leave it as 10. Then you're going to want to create a number and leave this at 0. You're going to want to connect the output to in. Then you're going to want to make another label, and this is going to be the number of time. So set this to zero, and again, change the number, font, and size to your liking. Now connect the output of the number to the value of the label. And then you're going to want to connect the plus number to the output of the timer. Now if we hit OK and go back to our scene view, we switch our layer to user interface, or UI for short, and you're going to want to move the timer and the number to wherever you want in it to be in your game. Now if you hit play, you'll see that the timer works. Hope you enjoyed this short tutorial. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you enjoyed.